Hey gamers, I'm back from break. Uh, I don't know when this is uploaded, but if it was uploaded on May 13th of 2020, then I'm not going to stream today, but if it was uploaded on um, May 14th, then I probably should be streaming. I don't know, though. It depends uh, how I feel that day, because I'm not feeling too well, sick, wise, ah, whatever. Um, I'm going to be talking about The Loud House. Now, I haven't really seen many videos on this topic I mean, of course, there were videos on it, uh, such as top 10 worst Loud House ships when I'm going over so much more than that because this community, I don't know how toxic it is, but it scares me because of all of the stuff I've seen, especially when you go to YouTube and you search up the Loud House, nothing else, just the Loud House. The 22nd video, I know that's kind of a lot of videos in, but if you're an avid Loud House viewer, I'm not. I used to be. I used to like that show. Well, I mean, I still kind of do. I haven't seen it in like two years now, but still. I even made a, um, a Loud House creepypasta. I still have it, too. It's in one of the notebooks I have around in my room. Uh, I actually have read it on stream. So, God, there was so much to talk about this show the show it's fine is nice it's just the community and the first thing i'm going to go over is the comics and the porn there is so much porn of the show and it's on youtube <laughs> it's sort of like gotcha youtube doesn't care about it they'll crop the images now the thing is these aren't even their images they'll just go to whatever porn site They'll go to Google Images, they'll go to Rule 34, the website, they'll search up the Loud House, download the image, crop it or censor it, and then they'll put it in whatever slideshow they're going to make, because there are so many slideshows, and oh my god, I know there was this one channel, I forget what it's called, uh, but they were, uh, they made a lot of Loud House videos, if it was like one of those AMVs, is that what it's called, I think that means like anime music video or something, I'm... I don't know what they call it. I guess LMV, loud music video. I don't know. I, I'm, I, I'm dead on the brain, so I don't really know. I don't know if they exist. They probably do. Uh, I forget the channel name. I think, fun fact, my most popular video used to be a video by Orthrio, or Oreo, however you say her name. And it was like, no, it wasn't by her, it was by the channel. And it was like Loud House and Undertale music reaction, something like that. Because I used to do reaction videos. I don't really do them that much anymore unless I do them on stream. Sorry that I'm talking rap god's pace, but, you know. Um, and I think the first thing I'm going to go into is the porn. There is so much of it. I just realized I should probably say this before everyone calls me homophobic in the comments and, uh, uh, racist don't know why i would be called racist but i remember no one likes me uh because everyone thinks i'm these ist things sorry that the camera angle was so low i'm not homophobic i'm not racist uh i'm not whatever phobic or ist that you guys think i am i don't like these videos because it's porn now you know of all my whole thing of porn. I like porn, of course. Who doesn't like porn? It porn is sexy. I like jerking off the porn. Who doesn't like jerking off the porn? Well, girls don't jerk off in the way that men do, of course. So is it really jerking off? Eh, it's debatable, I guess. I don't like these because it's underage kids having sex and it's incest. Incest itself is terrible, but underage underage sex and incest—they're two different things, and they're terrible. And the fact that sometimes they even got the mom involved. I haven't seen much of the dad, thank God. But <laughs> there's some of these where a child is having sex with his mother. And then, you know, the mom gets charges. They don't ever think of them being caught. Because you know, because the Loud House was not meant for this. The Loud House was not meant for pornography. It was not meant for the sisters and the brother having a giant orgy. Having sex. That's what an orgy is. is a large group of people doing the sexy things. Yes. It wasn't meant for that. And these people, I don't know if these are children. I don't know if these are adults making this. It's probably, you know, more mature people 
Because let's be real, an eight-year-old that watches the, Out How the Loud House isn't going to be making pornography. And if they are, I don't think an eight-year-old would be having some really good drawings that look like the show. Because if they are, Jesus Christ, that must be a very advanced eight-year-old. Now look at all these videos I'm going to show on screen. I should probably get in frame a bit more. This chair is really uncomfortable. I'm on the chairs that I fell off of and died. Do, 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 do. But look at all these videos. Oh, my voice. Look at all these videos I'm going to show you. Porn. Straight porn. Softcore porn. It's in the thumbnails. YouTube does nothing about this, by the way. Most of the videos I looked at, they're not age-gated. Meaning, kids can see this. Now, none of these are labeled for kids, too, which, you know, it's best. But some of these videos, like, they're getting an astronomical amount of views. And what is their age range? Because The Loud House was created for children. Uh, most of you probably, like, 99% of you know this. The Loud House was made for children. And there's a lot of videos by Nickelodeon, the channel, or the, uh, the channel on TV that created The Loud House. They get a lot of views. Does this mean whenever you know, some child wants to see The Loud House, but they've already caught up with all the episodes or something, and they want to look at some fan videos, or they just stumble upon these videos, and because it's The Loud House, it appeals to them. They click on it, and all the porn, everything is shown to them, and boom, one extra view for the Lincoln Loud channel. Now, I can't tell, because the the best way to know is by the comments, but guess what? These comments are like 99% Spanish. I don't speak Spanish. I only speak English. Now, I know you could say, oh, just translate it into Google Translate. Tr Google Translate is not that reliable, so it probably won't help me that much. Maybe it will a little bit, but probably not as much as people think. Now, maybe if I dug more deep into it, I would probably find a few uh, English videos. But most of these are just Spanish, and I don't feel like... Digging through all this Loud House porn and Loud House cringe just to find some English comments. Oh, God. Uh, I'm going to be going away from the Loud House porn to save my mental state and go more into of the cringe. I'm going to be only going over one channel, mainly because there are just so many channels. And I sort of want to save... Eh, I just want to save everything. From my brain. From seeing all this porn. I'm going to be going over this channel called It's Me, Just Me. It's one of those Loud House channels that mainly uploads slideshows. Not even her artwork. I'm going to go I'm gonna be going more in deep into that. Now, her most popular viewed video is not even hers. It's from the show itself. She, all she did is went into the, I don't know, the Nickelodeon website, or she pirated the episode, I don't care, to be honest. She recorded it, put it onto YouTube, boom, 8.7 million views. Now, I'm aware that, you know, there's TV clips everywhere of the TV shows, The Breaking Bad, The Walking Dead, you can name a TV show, and if you search it onto YouTube, you'll probably find TV clips, even of movies. There's a YouTube channel that specifically designed for movie clips. It's called, like, Fandigo or something like that, however you pronounce it. I'm pretty sure that's a movie theater company, and their YouTube channel is based just on clips of movies. Now, another one of her most viewed videos is of... is called The Loud House Fan Art or Slideshow. None of the artwork is hers. Literally none of it. She All she did was go to Google and typed in The Loud House Fan Art copy like 50 or something images, put it onto some editor, and boom, you got yourself a video. One in the video. And I'm 99% sure that she did not go to each and individual creator of the artwork, asked them, emailed them, go, went to one of their, uh, one of their social medias, and asked them, can I use your fan art for a video? And the same thing can be applied to her Loud House's Baby episode. I'm 99% sure she did not go to everyone who made those artworks, artworks, uh, artwork, 
and asked them, can I use your artwork for a video? I'm, like I said, I'm sure that she did not do that, meaning it's stealing of artwork and she never credited anyone. She didn't even say in these videos that none of this artwork was hers. She never said that. It's the, that's the funny part about it. Now, the last thing I want to talk about is, it's not all bad. The, the, the Loud House community isn't all bad. It's not all porn and cringe. I'm only going to go over one video. But there's this one video, I forget the guy's name, it's like Damien something, and it's actual animation. I recommend you check out this video, even if you don't like the Loud House, just to show that not all Loud House videos are bad. The video I'm going to be, well, not showing, but I'm going to be linking this video in the description. It, what it is, is it's Lynn getting bitten by a werewolf. I know in concept that sounds cringy. And, okay, I won't lie, it's a bit cringy. But it's actual animation. Like, it's not Animac or however you pronounce it. No, I don't hate Animac. There was one of my uh, favorite music videos, I guess you can say, on YouTube is uh, an Animac. It's like a fan creation for DA Games is um, whatever it was called, uh, his... Merry his Christmas episode and it was like a bunch of his songs combined not important but basically it's animation of Lin Loud being bitten by a werewolf and the only criticism I really have about it is I would prefer it if you took in the voice clips from the actual show because that would have made it seem more I guess realistic to the animation that's the only criticism I have about this it's an amazing video and I would recommend you check it out even if you don't like The Loud House. And that's going to be it for this episode. This took way longer than I expected to make. And I hope you enjoyed. And don't send hate to uh, the Lincoln Loud channel or It's Me, Just Me, or any other channels I've shown. Don't do that because then that would, you know, kind of be bad. I mean, they're bad and all, but, you know, I shouldn't have a wave of 100 people going and attacking these videos just dislike them for all i care if you are going to just dislike them don't even comment mainly because there's some of them are spanish and don't like the the werewolf episode bye and i will see you gamers later Ugh!